ready for some epic action that we've all been waiting for the whole week has been waiting for here we go here we go i'm excited guys i'm so excited <laughs> all right also no reshades so the game looks like poo i'm sad i'm sorry guys you don't get the best experience of looking at this game because reshade is a dick i'm really sad um all right guys let's do it plane is going to be coming in from the south end of the map uh and it's coming in sorry it's on the south end of the map it's coming in from the east uh moving all the way over towards the west we already see some players jumping out dodge lord vasili um together as well yeti aztec and striker with skits blank xd chef and howard holt moving up north to lapovka very interesting start especially uh since uh, it's not usual that we see uh looks like striker new uh person to this team as well um interesting to see if uh he's gonna be a good uh addition to that team interested to also see how the uh team of two only do kazan kazi and nick 101 jump in to the east side of milter very close to ben shu sub slayer josh and extrude as well seeing that map again we do finally see some players uh, dropping in we do see someone has disconnected um afk maybe not too sure we do still have 70 people in the game which is kind of confusing um to uh to say the least now we do have a lot of people jumping over at apartments as well and school you can see electric biggie j deaths won't kill you he's very close to these boys as well we're gonna be popping over deaths won't kill you does have an m1911 has taken a couple shots towards biggie j but biggie j has returned fire and deaths won't kill you has been put down to about five health already loving the action as we do see biggie j move back downstairs electric also pretty hurt that's when you're having to find any sort of uh bandage heals anything that he can he can't jump off the building he'll most likely kill himself if he does so definitely watch out for that that's when you're going to be taking the risk jumping down not actually losing any health but shots will be going out towards him though gasman though comes in and takes down tedesco that's when you now takes down biggie j and gasman will finish him off electric upstairs still as you see, Untainted will be coming in as well to help out his team. What a nice bit of teamwork right there. Electric, though he does have that Scarrell. No sight, but a nice full auto spray in any sort of position that he's in. Could come out with an easy kill or two. You never know. I mean, he's pretty close to this doorway as well. Uh, and here we go, Couchman. Very close. Could be heard right here. Electric going to be taking a big spray and takes Couchman down. Will finish him off as well continuing continuing on sorry with that spray oh it's so exciting to be back I'm so happy guys electric still waiting it out here in those footsteps all over the place we do see the circle has popped up now and it is focused on the southeast side of the circle now it looks like one of the uh, tater mines boys died it looks like joshi ended up going down as well in milter I don't know. I think my I think my voice sounds pretty cool now. It's like rich and sick, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? Love it. Anyway. Anyway, continue on. Electric does have a, a soda, but I don't think he's going to use it in fear of uh, where uh, these players are and they can push with hearing people. Looks like Daswaku does have a DP28. Is going to be using a bit of uh, energy drink as well. I mean, they know exactly where he is, especially since... Uh, that teammate did just die. He's going to be peeking out first. Shots go out towards Sunny. Oh, he moves back in. Grenade will be going out from Sunny G. Sorry, sorry Sunny B. Geez. Did he change his name? Oh, Electric not actually getting hit by that. But big shots going out from all of them. And that's why Killy will come in with a big spray of the DP28. And Untainted will finish him off. Gaining that precious loot. Love it. Love it. As we do notice not many people in Roshock for this starting uh map as well especially with that plane it's going to be kind of harder to get to there uh, but we do see prowl and cryptics au they are going to be to the east at sugar cubes now people potato could be the uh one to be taken down here he looks to be inside a, a bathroom though so i don't think he will be but he does have an m16 and a scarrell so real good weapons to start off um i'm starting to be way better with the, the m16 
That's also a lie. I hate it. I suck. <laughs> All right. We also do have a crate down to the west side of Milter Power. No one's gone for it yet, but we do see three teams moving in from that north side. Uh, sorry, the northwest side of the circle. Fuzzly and a teammate moving into Milter, possibly even going to this compound here. And they are going to be continuing on, actually. JCW very close as well to Vegetable Slayer. He's stopped up at this uh, building. He'll be here in that buggy as well. He only has a UMP, but spray is a spray. A shot goes out, but he will decide not to go for him. Now, Ceterix is going to be moving up here. Big jump with that bike. As we do see, shots do land towards Ceterix as he gets hit down to pretty uh, about half health, which is nice to see. Going back over here, we can see Lucid Freak. Fuzzly gets taken down. Vegetable Slayer, insanely low health with just one to two health. He is going up, though. There's big shots go out from Lucid Freak towards the buggy. Trying to blow it up. It looks like he won't be doing so just yet. It could have actually come out with a kill on Vegetable Slayer. He looks like he doesn't actually have any heals. And Destroy coming in will finish him off as a knockdown. Feels so good to be back, guys. Ah, it feels weird because it's only been a week, but like it feels longer because I've been in an event. A bit away. So, it's nice to see. Uh, oh, there's some shots going out still from the Lizard Freak. Just having some fun, trying to take down Vegetable Slayer. His team could still come and pick him up. Nope. Sorry, just gonna be blowing that up first for some reason. And then. Finally finishes off Vegetable Slayer with that SK-12. Destroy coming out with two kills. Shots going out from Kazan here towards NZ Snapshot. Trying to go straight through Milter with that bike. It looks like he does get by just with a few shots off. Now, Zoidmate is going to be following through as well. But you can see Cryptic is going to be moving in from the south end here. Uh, he's in a building. Extrude, uh, Benchu, and Subslayer just to the north of him as well. So it mate has managed to make it out alive as Lucifer does take a couple shots towards him as well. It's a snapshot very close into the middle of a lot of these players as he does take a few shots towards Uncry and Vasily. No, sorry, Yeti and Vasily. I don't know why I said Uncry. Snapshot. Looks like he actually did land a couple hits on that player as well. Look at the amount of players all up in here. They're just trying to find a compound for each other. And it looks like they won't be doing so just yet, Extrude. It looks like they moved up north uh, east of their original position. Chef will be taking some shots with Skits. As Prowl moves back down south. Nick 101 taking big shots towards Uncry Neff. And there we go. Uncry goes down and Neff. Is going to be in the ocean trying his best to get out of there. As they do notice some more lads move in towards a boat to the southwest. Grenade goes out towards him, but does not connect either. Watching that map again, we do see Shred plus another player move in. Big shots from Tainted Mines as they do take down a nice four piece. Beautiful spray, not even taking down the vehicle, I don't think and uh, making sure those shots hit. Very nice spray. Venture going out for some loot. So do hear some shots go out. JCW goes down, actually. I think it was possibly to extrude. Uh, looks like it was, so JCW. Got to be watching out for those windows, man. Trying to peek and take those hits. Every kill counts, but... Staying alive also counts too. Big shots go out from, uh, not too sure, Kozzy actually taking shots to God69. It's a snapshot. He's not afraid to shoot out in the open. He's away from his team. His team's actually incredibly spread right now. Um, it's going to be kind of interesting to see how they control this, especially with uh, snapshot being in such a big location. So many players are going to be uh, running that water strat right now. We do see Slags, like a part, uh, Roy, Roydy, sorry, and uh, another player inside, um, or kind of running the circle, trying their best to just chill out. 
gone. Hey boys, we don't need to do anything. It's, we're back. Week three, CGI. Let's do this. Let's have some fun, boys. Shots going out from Lucid Freak towards Blackjet and Zed. Looks like they do actually get hit down to half health. Lucid Freak does push over with that kind of air, but does notice some sh uh, some shots go out from that southwest. Trying to uh, scope down Nick 101. It looks like he won't be taking any shots too soon yet. Then that snapshot takes a few shots towards Blackout and Zed as well. It looks like they get into that same compound as uh, Zoid Mate and Heffa trying for a couple shots towards them as well. M16 has been equipped. And it won't be continued. There's Linksy alone again. Destroying Lucid Freak uh, alone in a compound as well. But a very nice central location. Shots going out up this northeast side towards Untainted. Skits going to be following uh, just a line trying to find where those players are. Going into a uh, bigger position here. Oh, an overhead position. So we do see uh, those players are going to be moving away. Link XD. Howard Holt is in a buggy. Now so many players are just going to be hugging this cliff face. Especially because we have uh, that, that circle. I mean waiting for that circle to come in. It looks like Peepy Potato has been taken down actually i apologize i didn't see that um they came through rosak they conquered and left him to die which is insane so champs over here pretty sure it's the same same team isn't it yeah oh no Woo! never mind maybe dano let us up never mind i saw i saw a meme that was weird they're both awake ready they didn't destroy it was all a lie it was all a dream unique though getting shot at here Trying to find who's taking shots. It's Yeti Aztec. Unique. Could be taken down here. He's on a single tree in the middle of two teams. Uh, well, actually, more than two. And they could easily see him. And they do. Unique is going to get shot from Black at NZ and taken down by Yeti, who did have that sight set on Unique, uh, Unique sorry, earlier. And Unique will be finished off by Yeti as we already, already planned. Beautiful. Clutch. God 69 goes down to Kazi. Shred will finish off God 69. Looks like Striker does have an M24. It is that um, crate that was up near Milter Power, possibly. Feels good that I'm, I didn't forget my mic's not muted. No. Well, what? Yeah, boy. Anyway, mic's not muted. Feels good, you know? Love it. Shots will be going out here from Kebab. Like a pot will be taking a few shots as well, but he is pretty low. Looks like he only has bandages to heal himself. Um, yeah, that's a, that's a bit of a shame right here. Kebab tool. Taking shots as well. Looks like they're so close to that circle, but they can't move out. They'll just get shot pretty easily. The deaths won't kill you. Also lying down on the edge here. Waiting. Speaking of edge, very close to edge. Oz, who's going to be moving into that circle. A lot of that water will be disappearing as well on the south side. So a lot of the players will be having to move in very close. So you do see the circle has moved in more uh, towards the... Oh, why did I go in the water? Lexi, get out of the water, please. Please. Linksy. Linksy. Oh, why is it bugs? Linksy, get out of the water. I hate it. I'm sorry, guys. I'm so sorry about that. It's the bug, the classic water bug that everyone loves to know. I really want to just talk to him. Say, can you get out of the water real quick? <laughs> please. Get out of the water. Linksy, please. Yes. Yes. <gasps> We're free. All right. That's something they really need to fix. I really need to fix that. Big shots going out from Neff in a boat. Is he in a boat? No, he's just on the on the edge. Neff takes down Stacky, and he's just left out in the open run rage. He's gonna be running down to him. He does have an AKM with a UMP. Only level one gear it looks like. No, level two vest though, which is a little helpful. But level one helmet and a level one backpack. Not too sure what he's been doing all game, but it's definitely not much. As we do see, Subslay is going to be taking some shots with a revolver suppressed. Uh, what's happening right now, man? Who's... Uh, uh, what? Why, though? Is that snapshot in that building? That's interesting to be using that. Sh 
shot has been heard to come out from Destroy and Lucid Freak, possibly. As we uh, pop open the map again. Still waiting. Neff just hanging out on that rock. Crush also to his northwest. Now here we go. Ron on uh, McClutch. Kazzy. And I can't see who else that is. Who is it? Shred. There you go. We're in a nice little spot. It's a good little defilade especially. But Linksy's... Uh, oh, actually, no, Linksy is on the, on the ground right there. Heffa is going to get shot a few times. By... It looks like McClutch was the one that took those shots. Pongo going to be staying inside. Shred's e going to easily be able to take out a lot of these boys. On that, de on that defilade, sorry. On that south end, they're able to get... Nice shot, stay in cover. Just have a nice little meme. Uh, up on the north side though, Roydy. He's getting pretty far away from his team. He's actually split up between two teams uh, on either side. Now untainted. Could end up seeing him move in here. And will easily take him down. But Roydy is a pretty decent shot. So he might actually be able to get... Uh, it might just be a fair fight here, but... With Untainted with the Deflate and Roydy running downhill. I don't know what he's doing. He's teabagging a little bit. New circle. And he's going to be favoring the water again. Linksy still in the circle. Hanging out by himself. Just chilling out. Will mean uh, a lot of these teams up on the north side especially will have to move. Uh, Roydy has moved down as well. As Untainted moved down as well. So it looks like... Uh, oh, Sunny. We'll be moving out on foot. Now, Roydy could be seen here. And there we go. He has been seen by Sunny. Oh, ho, ho, beautiful. But Sunny does have a Skyrell as well with uh, 2x Untainted. We'll be using a 4x M16. This is so exciting, guys. It's also really hot. Roydy. Out in the open. Untainted, aim down sights, but his teammates right in front of him, stop it! Trying to aim down sights, waiting for the teams to take shots, and there we go! Roydy gets hit once, twice, three times, if all everyone is counting at home, that's four! And Roydy's gonna be staying in the bush, thinking nobody can take him down! And Sunny will be coming in with a knockdown, and hopefully execution on Roydy. Deathswain Q coming in as well on that northwest. Cryptics AU goes down. Yeti Asset will be taking a big sway on champs with an AKM. Looks like he does have a compensator on that as well, which will definitely help that AKM. Vasily also taking some shots at Ez Edge Oz, sorry. And Peeper Potato does actually get hit by Vasily. Big shots as Edge Oz goes down to DJ Arnie with an M416. Peeper Potato has been seen as well. He's just going to be having a little bit of fun moving over towards that position. Linksy and Chance very close to each other now. So Critical Motion is also going to be moving up to uh, Peeper Potato. Seen those shots still go out. Yeti Aztec trying for those long shots. The 8x uh, suppressed Scar L. Extrude NZ. Three people left in their team. Extrude being one of them. They do have a total of four kills. Doing pretty well. In a nice little compound on that north uh, west side. But they do have a lot of teams very close to them. And if they all have to move at the same time, it's not going to be good. Kazid trying to run away right here. Tabali could easily take out a good shot here on Black and NZ. As he does uh, peek out pretty hard with that level 3 uh, helmet. You're not going to... I mean, you're not going to get taken down one hit. But you are going to get damaged pretty hard. Serb goes down to Kozzi. And they will decide to push up here, knowing that one of them will definitely go for the res. Nick101 will be coming around for that flank. Will Nick101 do what he does best and get a nice triple kill? You never know. M416 with a red dot. I think it's going to happen. He comes up. Big spray. Tries to figure out who he's going to shoot first. And there they go. Because he comes in and takes the two first. Nick101 just trying his best. He doesn't know what to do with himself. As DJ Arnie takes down on Tainted 26 using that buggy. Yeti Aztec still taking a few shots going for the knockouts. And will be finishing him off. Getting his team easy kills. 
very annoying thing for those players that do take those plays down. Like a pot trying his best to get out of that position, but Chris Vision 6 takes him down with an immediate kill. Circle will be uh, repositioning now as Yasu will be picked up from their team. There we go. Nice reposition right into the center of the map. Linksy still in the circle. Looks like he may be solo now in his team. That's McClutch here. For those wondering as well, by the way, uh, the reason why uh, I don't do preloading the map because it is literally 10 FPS the whole game. So if you ask me, oh, why is it the map not loading properly? It always loads in. It's literally for everyone. Happens all the time. Get over it. We're looking for people playing the game instead, not the buildings going, loading in the whole time. You know what I mean? Like, let's just chill out, you know? Striker though, does have no kills, but he does have a knockdown with that M24, but it looks like they do get picked up. M24 suppressed with an 8X. Let me watch it out here. Is Yasu Cage. Oh, I crazy. Should straight through the smoke. He does see Yasu Cage straight through it. Trying for that leading shot. But it looks like he won't be able to do any kills just yet. Eight seconds left for that circle to move in. And shots will be going out from Kazi here. Controlled shots just to suppress them. See if they can get them down while the rest of his team moves. The shred does actually get hit right there from Kazi. Kazi now going to be moving into the north side too. He does get hit as well. Big shots going out everywhere up on this north side. Death Zone Kill trying his best to move in as Sub Slayer. It's just going to be moving in as well. Bench Yu goes down. As Extrude does try to take out Death Zone Kill you. What is that gun? Mini Uzi suppressed. Death Zone Kill you would be pushed here by Extrude. A big shots going out from Destroy here as Sub Slayer almost goes down to him as well. Silly. Taking easy shots as Yasu actually doesn't go down. Ludo staying behind that rock. We'll be just chilling out, but a good grenade pushes him pretty far. And Strike will get that knockout. Finishing him off with a nice little couple hits. Dodge Lord just above Yasu K. Jetty Aztec is just going to be pushing in, waiting for it. A nice controlled frag throw right into the corner. Not on the other side. He doesn't know that. Yasu Cage is in a great position there. Striker going to be taking shots at Bench U, switching back to the M24. Sub Slayer dead on the ground there as well. Moving down to the southeast side. Linksy still alive. Doesn't have to move. Crush swimming out as well. Champs just has to wait for him to move. There's Neff and Dak also in the ocean. Sunny also doing the same, uh, same thing. That's Destroy over here. Taking some shots at Deathwing Kill, he's still alive, but he goes down to Vasily. And Destroy will go for that execution, stealing that kill. Five teams total for his team, but Destroy, the carry for his team, gets taken down by Strike with that M24. And Destroy will be executed. New circle will be coming up now very shortly in a couple seconds as we do watch. I'm sorry it's not as crazy exciting with my voice as I do have a really bad throat. I've actually quite ill. As a new circle does come up, it is on the south end. Only one team, actually two teams, sorry, in the circle, which does mean a lot of these players are going to have to move out in the open. JCW taking shots at a vehicle, just keeping cover for them so they don't get taken down when they most don't need it. Champ still waiting it out. Shred, McClutch, Kazzy, and Ronan hanging out here. Heifer, Kazi, and Kazan. Pongo taking shots, pop shots at each other. 34 seconds left. Kazan. Could have been seen by Pongo there as Kazi is also going to be running out. Not sure if Pongo knows as Kazan does get a nice spray. Kazan takes down Pongo as Heifer is left inside that building. B 
Big shots are going to go out here as Kazan is actually just going to be rucking out in the open. Kazan and Kazan probably have no idea there's so many players around here. As Heffa is still in that building. Just going to be having to chill. Wait for it. Shot goes out to steer him away. Critical motion for Potato. Taking a couple shots out to those boys out in the ocean. As here we go. We do see Chef Big Dog. Critical motion switching to the M16. M416, sorry. Two shots left. He runs out of ammo in a worse time. It's Pipo Potato who's on the top of it. And they all are alive. And well, Blank XD just below. Grenade will be underarm thrown. That was a beautiful grenade, but it won't actually connect. But a grenade will be going out from those boys as well. I'm about to sneeze. Oh, no, it didn't happen. Oh, no, it's going to happen. No, it didn't. What the hell is happening to my face? Blinks, he's still in the ocean, but he has gotten hit to half health. Grenades going out everywhere here. As big shots are heard up on that northwest. Sand Zed snapshot. Just lying down. He does see Niku's crush. No idea where he is. As it looks like Skits is out of the water. Taking shots at Insight. Insight goes down. This is the team of two. Skits could just take it easy here. As DJ Arnie is going to actually push back through that west side. Vasily and Dodge Lord has been seen possibly by DJ. Or at least Vasily. Khan 98 with a... Uh, with an 8x, sorry, not suppressed. Vasily goes down in one hit. Dodge Lord has now been seen by DJ. Jumping up and down. DJ trying his best to scope him out. But he's in the circle. He has to run. Dodge Lord will easily be able to take him down. But Striker comes in and takes the complete kill. As he does push pretty hard. New circle will come up now. As we do watch. There it is. New circle focusing on to the southwest side as McClutch does take a few shots towards the Eddie Aztec. Shred. Oh, McClutch does get hit right there. I'm not too sure by who. But look at the amount of players in the ocean there. Favoring a lot of these teams. These two teams having to be easily take them out. I don't even know what I just said. But Yeti Aztec and this team could actually take him down if they peak too early. And they're just watching that spot. Vasily has still been taken down. They're not actually going to go for that res. He's not even near anyone else. But out in the open, left alone. Smokes will be going out by Yeti now. He could easily get picked up, but the risk, you know. The classic risk. Check Big Doug with Car 98. Just taking pop shots. Sunny, Neff, Linksy, Memes, Dak and Crush still in the uh, little, little sea, little beach. Having a little bit of a dip. This McClutch is going to be the one taking the most amount of shots right here. He does see so many of these players. JCW. Destroy. Does actually get pretty uh, pretty badly hurt as Yeti is also on half health. His team following up as well. They could just easily take out these, sh uh, these vehicles. Uh, but I think the, uh, the UAZ is one of the ones that are been taken out already. Now, here we go. With that circle moving in, we are going to be seeing a big amount of shots go out of Skits. It's going to be the first one to take shots at Champs. Champs goes down, but Skits will go down as well out in the open. Peeper Potato moving in. The Chef Big Dog has been seen. Big shots go out from Peeper Potato as Chef goes down. Critical motion comes in for that execution. Now, Neff still alive down below. Blank XD will be taken down as Howard Holt trying to heal up first before he can try to pick up his teammate. Now, Critical Motion will be moving in. Blank XD goes down. Neff still around the side. He takes a few shots as Howard Holt goes down to Neff. Neff almost getting taken down by that circle. As Beaver Potato and Critical Motion both moving in. They have both have been seen, but Neff, Neff taking some shots of P, but there we go. Critical takes down Neff. Critical goes down as well to Ronon. Shred takes down JCW as we do see a lot of those players moving around. Seven total kills for this team. Speed Potato is still alive as well. Kozzy. Lucid Freak outside of the circle has been taken down. Not sure what he was doing exactly. Tazzy runs out of ammo for his M16. Switches to the M416. Puts an ACOG on. He'll be taken just a nice little wait here in the grass. Shred is going to be taking a couple shots towards Kazi. 
Ozzy goes down and possibly pick it, uh, picked up as well. Flashbang's going out. As we do see, Kazzy will be taking a nice little flank here and taking down Kazi and Kazan. It's the true soldier boys trying their best. We don't get to live just now. Just now? I don't know what's going on in my mind. Niku's though over towards the uh, the northwest. He will be lying down and having to snack in. 36 seconds left. And it looks like that knock did get taken down. Niku's versus four. Can he do it? He's in a defilade. He has to move. No more meds. No more helmet. I'm, I'm scared for you, Niku's. But can you at least get one kill? A knock and an execution. If you can do that... I'll be happy, you know. His, his team will be very happy. I'll be happy. They won't. But, you know, <laughs> that's what happens. Nikus is going to be starting to crawl up to the north side. As that full team is actually incredibly close to each other. But with such good cover, I suggest... Uh, well, I mean, the, the best way to move right now is uh, Nikus moving with the trees. Using the shade. It looks like he's going to go out into the open here. Towards the north side. Even taking out all of his stuff. Don't think it's going to help him. We are going to be moving over to these boys. Shred. Kazzy just watching directly where he is. He's not actually got any ammo in his M16. I don't think he knows. Now he's going to be reloading. Shots do go out from the boys. I don't know if they did see him. I think they did. Yep, yeah, Nikus has been hit by the circle. He's going to go down to the circle. Not giving him any kill. Clever idea. And there we go. Kazzy coming in. With five, Shred with four, McClutch with one, and Ronan with one. GG, guys, for the first game. Thank you so much for watching. We'll be back with the second game very shortly, and the match results and stuff will be coming up. Uh, they'll take just a little bit of time to refresh. So if it looks like they're all up, they aren't. They're just going to be refreshed. So yeah, give me a bit, guys. Enjoy the tunes.